Hey guys, it's Matt with AppleMediaCenter.com and today's tip is uh, going to show you how to access and optimize YouTube for playback on your Apple Media Center computer. Um, so what I'm going to do right now is show you how you would typically access YouTube uh, without any plugins or anything at all and then I'm going to show you what it looks like after you've done my quick plugins through Firefox and added the little web weblet whatever the hell you call it, which uh, you'll put in your docs so you can access YouTube really quickly. So without further ado, let's just jump right into it. So if you want to watch a video on YouTube right now, what you would do uh, would be you'd put in YouTube.com in your browser, which for me is Firefox, and then you would just type in what you'd like to see. So let's say you've got a bunch of friends over and you want to see Rihanna's video for her new track, Rude Boy. You type it in, it's the first one there, we're going to click that, we are going to enlarge it, it's going to start playing, and all is right in the world, right? Well, if you're with a bunch of your friends from the television, it's a little annoying when all of a sudden an ad pops up. So you have to go and take your mouse or whatever you're using and then close that out and then let it go back to doing what it's doing. Not the biggest thing in the world, but if you're going to do this for several music videos throughout the night or videos of any kind, it gets a little frustrating. So there's got to be a better way. And there is, and that's what we're going to do right now. If you follow all the steps in this uh, very brief guide, what you should have now is uh, an icon, a YouTube icon that you can drag to your dock, so you can just click it once and open up YouTube. Uh, and where we kind of failed before with this video with the ads popping up, let's see if we can get it again. Um, now what will happen, well, let me lower my volume so I don't blow your ears off. Once this starts playing, uh, the ads will no longer show up because of Adblock Pro, which is going on right here. Um, so you can play music videos all day long, not to worry about getting up to click something because it's advertising God knows what. And if you're ever watching like a 30 second video and have to close something out just because an ad popped up, it's really, really helpful. Additionally, down here, because of uh, Easy YouTube Video Downloader, you can download the video to save for later and play it off your desktop. Or you can download just the MP3. So you can actually play this song uh, in iTunes, bring it with you in your iPhone. Don't know the legality of that, but uh, that's, that's up to you. <laughs> so I hope you liked the tip. I hope it was very helpful. Definitely will save you a bunch of time. And that's it. Matt R. signing off for AppleMediaCenter.com.